क्वेश्चन नंबर वन फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ द फॉलोइंग डिटर्मिनेंट इन डिटर्मिनेंट फाइव टू सेवन फोर विच इज इक्वल टू फाइव इंटू फोर माइनस सेवन इंटू टू इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी माइनस फोर्टीन विच इज इक्वल टू सिक्स find the value of the following determinant in determinant 3 root 6 minus 4 root 2 5 root 3 2 is equal to 2 into 3 root 6 minus in bracket minus 4 root 2 into 5 root 3 Which is equal to six root six plus twenty root six is equal to twenty six root six. Express the following information in mathematical form using two variables. The perimeter of rectangle is thirty-six centimeter. Solution: Let the length and breadth of a rectangle be x centimeter and y centimeter, respectively. We know that perimeter of rectangle is equal to two into length plus breadth. Therefore, from the given information, we have. 2 into x plus y is equal to 36. Therefore, x plus y is equal to 36 divided by 2. Therefore, x plus y is equal to 18. Express the following information in mathematical form using two variables. The cost of two tables and five chairs is rupees two thousand two hundred. Solution: Let the cost of one table be rupees x, and cost of one chair be rupees y. Then, two x plus five y is equal to two thousand two hundred. write the coordinates of the point of intersection of x axis and y axis if you see this graph you will notice that the coordinates of point of intersection of x axis and y axis are 0 0 If dy is equal to minus fifteen and d is equal to minus five, are the values of determinant for certain simultaneous equations in x and y? Find y. If dy is equal to minus fifteen and d is equal to minus five, we know that. As per Cramer's rule, y is equal to dy by d. Therefore, y is equal to minus fifteen upon minus five. Therefore, y is equal to three. What is the equation of x-axis? Hence, find the point of intersection. of the graph of equation x plus y is equal to 3 with the x axis 
solution. Equation of the x-axis is y is equal to 0. Therefore, substituting y is equal to 0 in the equation x plus y is equal to 3, we get x plus 0 is equal to 3. Therefore, x is equal to 3. Hence, point of intersection of the line x plus y is equal to 3 with the x-axis is 3 comma 0. Question number 8. Find dx for the following simultaneous equations. Number 1. 3x plus 4y is equal to 8 and x minus 2y is equal to 5. Here, a1 is equal to 3, b1 is equal to 4, c1 is equal to 8, a2 is equal to 1, b2 is equal to minus 2 and c2 is equal to 5. By Cramer's rule, dx is equal to indeterminant c1 b1 c2 b2 which is equal to indeterminant 8 4 5 minus 2 is equal to 8 into minus 2 minus 5 into 4 is equal to minus 16 minus 20 which is equal to minus 36. Therefore, dx is equal to minus 36. Without actually solving the simultaneous equations given below, decide which simultaneous equations have unique solutions, no solution or infinitely many solutions. Number 1. 3x plus 5y is equal to 16 and 4x minus y is equal to 6. Comparing these equations with the equations a1x plus b1y is equal to c1 and a2x plus b2y is equal to c2, we get a1 is equal to 3, b1 is equal to 5, c1 is equal to 16, a2 is equal to 4, B2 is equal to minus 1 and C2 is equal to 6. Now, A1 upon A2 is equal to 3 upon 4. B1 upon B2 is equal to 5 upon minus 1 and C1 upon C2 is equal to 16 upon 6 which is equal to 8 upon 3. As a1 upon a2 is not equal to b1 upon b2, the simultaneous equations 3x plus 5y is equal to 16 and 4x minus y is equal to 6 have unique solutions.